In an earlier video, we saw that grape seed proanthocyanidins increase NAD. In this study, which was done in rats, we can see that the highest proanthocyanidin content of 50 mg per kilogram increased liver levels of NAD by about fourfold. Similarly, in a study that was done in middle-aged mice, 18 months old, 18M, when these mice were fed grape seed proanthocyanidin extract, GSPE, we can see about a threefold increase for plasma levels of NAD. However, no human studies have yet tested the ability of grape seed proanthocyanidins to impact NAD levels. So with that in mind, for NAD test number six, I sent blood to Genfinity for analysis, and if you're interested in measuring your own levels of NAD, there'll be a discount link in the video's description. So there, the hypothesis was if I supplement with grapeseed powder as a source of proanthocyanidins, will that raise my NAD? And I wish I could say that it could or did, but it didn't. Grapeseed powder did not raise my NAD. As we can see, 19.9 micromolar is my lowest NAD reading over, the, over these six tests. Now, to, uh, to note how much grapeseed powder that I was taking, uh, it was 6.1 grams per day, and I did this experiment for 19 days. And note that in the last video, I showed published amounts of grapeseed proanthocyanin content in grape seeds, and based on the lowest amount, which is about 107 milligrams per gram of grapeseed, I took in about 648 milligrams of proanthocyanidins at the lowest. It could be higher, but that's based on published values for how much is in grapeseed. Now, just using the rat study as an example, the human equivalent dose for that study, for that fourfold increase in NAD, was about 536 milligrams of grapeseed proanthocyanidins. So technically, I should have at least seen some bump or some increase in NAD, but I didn't. So with that in mind, what's next? I've used NMN in the past, but for the next test, I'm going to use niacin. And why I'm going to go with niacin, besides cost, uh, I'll cover that in a future video. All right, that's all for now. If you're interested in more about my attempts to biohack aging, check us out on Patreon. And before you go, we've got a whole bunch of discount links and merch that you may be interested in, including discount links for at-home metabolomics, NAD quantification, green tea, epigenetic testing, and telomere testing, which is also included in that test, oral microbiome composition, at-home blood testing with Cyfox Health, and note that their biomarker panel is mostly different from the at-home metabolomics and also includes ApoB, diet tracking, or if you'd like to support the channel, you can do that with the website, Buy Me A Coffee. We've also got merch, so if you're interested in wearing the Conquer Aging or Die Trying brand, that link and all the other links will be in the video's description. Thanks for watching. I hope that you enjoyed the video. Have a great day.